Hi Prabhu here today we will see about how to render smooth object without any mesh smooth or tree smooth using arnold in maya 2017 stay tuned Okay today we will see about how to render the smooth object without any mesh smooth or tree smooth so arnold has an ability to render the smooth object without mesh smooth or tree smooth okay now we have simple objects over here so i have some basic shape so i didn't have any mesh smooth or tree smooth this object so i will apply some ai standard material and choose some color and choose some specular values so nothing special so now we want to make sure test render this one so i will open my arnold render view okay it's render completed now you able to see our object the edge has some jagginess so because it's an normal object so i didn't have any smooth for this object so now i keep this snapshot for our comparison so i will click on this one so that means it will take our snapshot so now i select any object in my scene now go to attributes editor in shape node you need to expand the arnold and choose you need to find subdivision here we have type so i will choose my type to cat clock so you need to give some iteration so i will give iteration to 1 so now we want to see what we have okay it's render completed now you able to see our object has smoothness so we will compare the previous frame so i will click on the snapshot button so now i check my snapshot one so this is a normal object with lot of jagginess so in snapshot 2 we give some subdivisions in render so that means it has smooth object so arnold has an special property to render the object as smoothness so now we give smoothness for all other objects so i will select this object i will give iteration to 1 in subdivision and choose cat lock cat lock so i will select this one and choose subdivision to cat lock and give iteration to 1 so i will uncheck this i and render again okay now you able to see this three object have smoothness so i will compare the previous frame so i will click on the snapshot button so i will select my snapshot to you able to see this object has lot of jagginess so i will select this snapshot tree now you able to see our object has smoothen so because we add this three object of subdivisions so i will select this object so we will give some subdivisions but this poly cube didn't we have give any subdivisions see here this object has even number of edge loops of all the sides so of all object but in our poly cube we didn't have any edge loops added over here so now i take render for this object so i will select my poly cube so i will give subdivision to cat clock and give iteration to 1 so now i uncheck this i to render what we have so i will uncheck this one okay now you able to see our poly cube will be change in roundness because we give some subdivisions so it's happen because of we need to add number of edge loop for over here so see here i will click on the snapshot i will compare the previous frame so our poly cube will be change in as roundness so now i will select this poly cube i will go my channel box i will expand my inputs so i will give some number of divisions 
to this object so like this so now I take my test render again so I will uncheck this I ok it's render completed now you able to see our polycube with perfect smoothness so I will compare the previous frame click on the snapshot button so I will select my previous frame so see here it will be in rounded shape because we didn't give any subdivision so but this snapshot you able to see the perfect cube because because we give some subdivision value so remember if you take some smooth mesh render you need to give some even number of subdivision so that means it will render the perfect shape click subscribe button to subscribe our youtube channel we always need your support to create high quality content further so please subscribe click here to also watch the tutorial of how to use refraction ray depth in maya 2017 using arnold render engine it's really helpful when you have multiple transparent object or glass material in your scene